I'll go give Jugs her present now. Do you think we'll win? Win what? Check us! In the end. It feels like something is ending, doesn't it? Do you think we'll win? Nothing is ending, Meryl. Things are a little tense, but it will pass. Yeah. I hope we win. Barrick will make it a good story, it I'm sure. Ace. I hope I mean. Oh yeah, somebody pointed out that apparently Matthew made a Finding Nemo reference in that one video, and I didn't pick up on it because, you know, I didn't watch it because I'm not a kid toucher that goes to children's <laughs> movies and with his pants off. <laughs> <laughs> he probably doesn't even remember Nemo's doing it. Nemo hot! Ew. What was the reference? Man? He doesn't remember. I don't remember. Something about blowing fish or something. <laughs> Let's go do the Sebastian thing, whatever that is. Something stupid, I'm sure. No, Matthew, not the crab in Little Mermaid. Sebastian the Archer. Yeah, I'm gonna if, see. No, don't. <laughs> I will <laughs> kill you. When the Sweet the law, you're, you're a faggot. Music to me. Oh, shut up. <laughs> you really should. <laughs> Exciting. Bitches. What was she doing back there in the corner? Please. Masturbating furiously. <laughs> I knew I should never should have gotten her that dildo staff at the store. <laughs> oh, I'll keep this up. They're making Saints Row 3 now. Holy shit, really? And uh, I, I saw a picture of the gameplay. There was some chick holding a giant bat shamed like, shaped like a cock. <laughs> she was hitting somebody with it. No, Matthew, I will not send you the picture. Uh. <laughs> if you don't already have better ones than that, anyway. Matthew's got pictures of him holding a cock, and it's not his own. Oh. <laughs> Damn you, Facebook. I caught him with a cock in his hand, he's like, What? I'm playing Saints Row 3! I'm like, yeah, sure you are. Where's the, Where's your controller? He's like, right here! And he started juggling some balls. <laughs> You're filthy and a pig and you're dull. Hmm. You know what, Smeagol? Words hurt. That's right. We make a specialty in hurting people with words. Damn. That's all we can do. Damn it! I have to bring Sebastian with me. Yeah! I'm Shut gonna up! See. <laughs> you fucking fruit. Matthew being murdered, it's music to me! <laughs> what do they get a lot of sand? We got the hot crustaceans! Matthew's man. asshole is full of man! <laughs> <laughs> Each little cock you up, Matthew's butt you under the sea! Alright. We all know the melody way too well, so I think we should all commit ritual suicide now. <laughs> Seppuku! Now! Oh yeah, I forgot. About uh, again, meeting up with another Dragon Age 1 character that I was supposed to. Uh, I don't remember what her. A strange place for a holy Open system. it, fag! We're all walking like idiots. So, even the divine fears uh oh! It's the evil girl we pope! Should. Kill the spies! How dare you! Kill the Blood wabbit. magic, huh? Kill I got some of that too, bitches! Clean! She disappeared. Oh shit, West just kicked her ass. No, she disappeared. She probably appeared somewhere else, but I don't see her. Ah, oh, there's that bitch. Ow! Uh oh. I'm gonna die. Oh shit. I wasn't paying attention to my health. Give me some of your hit points, Avalyn. You don't need those, you dirty bitch. Uh -oh. oh, he's dead. Oh well. Sebastian! No big loss! God damn, that blood mage keeps disappearing and reappearing everywhere. I've been killed! Got her. I'm gonna march straight home and don't you shake your head at me, young lady. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm gonna use fire on these obvious fire enemies and it's still gonna kill them. What? I'll tell you what Matthew would say. He'd say he'd have himself a cock, that's what Matthew would say! Alright, both officially gay ones. Uh-oh. Guess who's Did showing up? Oh, shit. Everybody dead! It's the Lesbo! Oh, my God. It's the, the resolutionists. Her head's back on. I might have known yep. they would be part of this. 
Can you turn your head? I want to see if there's stitches or staples or something there holding your head back on. And you are... As if we don't know. Are you Sister Nightingale? I am. Oh, same sweet really Nightingale. The Divine sent me to investigate the possibility of a Shut up. here in Kirkwall. Without informing the guards, of course. This is an unconventional situation. I... Have some experience with those. You mean like girl on girl action? Oh yeah, Liliana. The Liliana. Oh. Who accompanied the hero of Ferelden to slay the Archdemon? Ah, I see. It will be harder to remain anonymous so near the Ferelden border. I know, right? Yes, I knew the hero of Ferelden. In bed, asshole. She is an excellent queen for King Alistair. Oh, never mind. but that was many years ago. I am working for the Divine now, in Orle. I had not thought to return to this part of Thedas. The Resolutionists? Who are the Resolutionists? An offshoot of a fraternity within the Circle of Magi. Huh? There have always been factions that support freedom from the Chantry, and the abolition of the Circle. We have tolerated Well, them. that's nice of you. But the Resolutionists have become violent. They are likely behind the unrest you here. Dicks. You're not what I expected. I hardly imagined the Divine Secret Agent looking like you. That is why I am effective. The Divine has long suspected that Kirkwall's problems were spurred by an outside group. This attack proves she is right. You knew they would attack and you still sent me in here, dicks? Are you saying you set this whole thing up? I let word slip that an agent of the Divine was coming to investigate the mage troubles. It is how they chose to react which condemns them. Yep, same old girl won't anymore. ever stop talking. It's really not that bad. Seriously, you guys don't have to come in and fuck with me. A few... Uh, wild cards aside. <coughs> Grand Cleric Elthina has it all under control, I swear. And provocations don't help. That's right. Divine Justinia takes the situation here very seriously. I don't give a shit what she does. She believes it is the worst threat to Thedas since the Cunara invaded. Canaries. A handful of apostates. How can that possibly... <laughs> the whole world is watching Kirkwall. If it falls to magic, none of us are <gasps> safe. Tell Elthina to leave. There is refuge for her at the Grand Cathedral in Orle. All right. She will not be safe here. I'll say she won't. Will she get naked again? Nope. Damn it. She didn't get naked in the first game. These anymore. mages are out of control. You're going to see man ass anyway. These mages are out of control? Oh, yeah. oh, wait a minute. Two of you are mages. Maybe I should shut my fucking mouth. Stupid Sebastian. Don't. Resist. <laughs> That's right, Matthew. Put it all the way in. <laughs> what this sub shell I'm turning out to be. Uh-huh. That's getting deleted. <laughs> Owned. Yeah, fucking fruit pet. I've seen that movie way too many damn times. Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, you're molesting children. <laughs> you sick fuck. Hey, little girl. I have a nice shiny red ball for you. You want to watch a movie? Why don't you stick your hand in the popcorn bucket and see what's in there? Hooray, Liliana's back. Uh, Yay. considering how she shows up in the game like that there, I'm pretty <laughs> sure even if I would used my men chisel backstory, that she still would have been there, even though, you know, she should be dead. How do your divines choose their names? They write all the best sacred oh, names. Shut the fuck up, Sebastian. We don't want to hear it. <laughs> and you too, Matthew. We don't want to hear it. Still talking. Time to give Jugs an awkward gift. Surprise! Uh, I see. It's a gift! Sometimes people get things for other people they like. This is the part where you say thank you. I know that you goose. Hey! Ooh! Language! Do you know what this is? 
It's a Ravini fertility. Oh, jeez, give me that back. Whoa. These petal like shapes represent certain fleshy bits. And this protrusion is. Well, just look. It's a cock. <laughs> I know it's a what it chip. is. <laughs> <laughs> it's a cock and balls! <laughs> You know much about talismans? Talisman? You're an expert on Ravani talismans, are you? My mother was a Ravani seer. Or, rather, she pretended to be. She knew enough about the old tribal practices to put on a convincing act. Yeah, bunch of fucking she used to gypsies. Hand these things out to women all the, the hell's time. up with that camera angle? That give me weird. the cookie! Give me the cookie! Nobody fucks with Rainbow fucking Randolph! I'm sure that we're the only people in the world that have seen that movie and probably that and, and, that have seen it and enjoyed it. Death That's to Smoochie. Okay. Fantastic yes, movie. They got it. I'm sure. John Stewart was Oh in yeah, it. now I see the cock. Oh. <laughs> oh dear. And all this time I oh, thought it was just a, a vagina. <laughs> Ravani women would wear I didn't recognize it as yours because it wasn't all stretched out and saggy. Is blessed with many children. <laughs> years of overuse. Not that they worked, of course. <laughs> Seems to me you either have a fruitful womb or you don't. Thank you. It's nice to have something to remind me of my homeland. You're welcome, barren womb. Oh. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go talk to short stuff. Got a minute, Hawk? I know this is ancient history, but remember oh, that yeah. high town house. You need Bartram to help, help him with a haunted house. In? Bartrand doesn't exactly need the place now that he's in the sanitarium. I've been trying to sell it. He's in the planetarium. Buyers will be thrilled. Planetarium shuckers! I can only imagine there's a huge market for the homes of deranged killers. Well, the creepy sort of people who are interested are generally not the ones with the coin to take it off my hands. I found a minor noble in Ravane who bought the place sight unseen. But now there's a problem. Mm -hmm. They say the place is haunted. <gasps> The veil was torn. Bartran's atrocities must have weakened the barrier between this world and the Fade. Maker, I hope not. I don't think I can fix the veil through applied use of force. They've noticed some minor problems. Uh, voices whispering in the walls, apparitions, things moving on their own. Read really? the ghost adventures. My hope is it's a relic Bartran brought back from the deep roads. We smash it and the haunting stops. And if we don't? What happens if we do nothing? Best case, they drag me before the Seneschal and accuse me of fraud. Sweet. I mean, oh, that's The bad. worst case involves Antiven crows. Nice. Hmm, birdies. What do you need me for? Just go in there and clean it up. Can't you do this yourself? No kidding. Hawk, I'm a businessman. Now and then, I shoot people. <laughs> I don't know anything about ghosts or magic. Or hygiene. It's entirely possible you. that even if I find the thing that's causing the trouble, I won't be able to stop it on my own. What if that don't fix it? I'm not an expert on hauntings, but what if smashing something does not make the problem? That better? always fixes things, damn it. Ah, I'll that's be stupid. Where things get tricky. You're a mage. You must know something about weird shit. I'm friends with a dwarf. I'm sure you'll be able to figure something out that That's will some help. pretty weird shit. Did All he right, just curse? <gasps> Very well. We'll investigate the mansion again. Thanks, Hawk. I knew you wouldn't let me down. I am afraid no good. Not. That the, king... the hell are you doing over there, Matthew? <laughs> what are you laughing about, stupid ass? I, just made a stupid -ass comment. <laughs> I didn't hear it. What was it? I am afraid no goose. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. And you should not have asked! Fuck you. <laughs> you fucking used to be a person. I was a hobbit! Or something. Was he a hobbit? I don't remember what he was. Shut up, you! Nobody gives a damn what you think. We're gonna go help this genetic disaster clear out the haunted house. Yay! I never believed in ghosts until I came face to face I with one. What the fuck are you babbling about, man? Ghost adventurers! Oh my god! Come on! Nobody watches that piece of shit bullshit show. It's awesome! It's fucking fake as hell. You have now reached your final destination. It's faker hell. than a message from Matthew's invisible girlfriend. 
Did Sarah call me again? Yes, Matthew, Sarah called you. Oh, goody, we're going to get right. married. Yay. Yeah, sure. Somebody's getting married. Okay. Today. <sighs> That's right. I'm related to the Muppets. <laughs> waka, waka, waka. Kaka, kaka, kaka. Do your animal impression, Matthew. That's, yeah, that's, that's baby animal. animal. <laughs> Thank you very much. Perfect babies! Matthew is a tool! <laughs> Excuse me! <laughs> oh, bye bye! God, you guys are fags. <laughs> Water? Dirt? Make mud! Yeah! <laughs> God damn it. You suck. All right, let's finish this faith quest, and then we'll go do the haunted house. Only Matthew would remember obscure quotes from the Muppet Babies cartoon. Then again, he's got the whole DVD set, and he jacks off to it every night. <laughs> Baby animal gets him all hot. I found out I wanted to be a rocket scientist when I saw Scooter make an airplane by computer. You're not a rocket scientist. And anymore. then Skeeter I'm, made a, a better like airplane. <laughs> Skeeter. Only story I can Shut never tell. up. What would you say to an exciting trip to Orlais? Yeah. I hear We're shipping you off to Orlais. Lovely this time of year. What? You were right. The divine will be taking action against Kirkwall, though the sister didn't say what. You must take the holy relics from the chantry and leave for safety. Sebastian, I'm surprised at you. Andraste would not thank me for saving a few dusty finger bones and my own skin at the cost of people's lives. Dusty finger bones? What the hell are you keeping in this place? You keep dead people here. The Kirkwall Chantry has guarded the remains of the martyr Devrina for 800 years. They must be protected. Oh, well that makes sense. When we wouldn't I want her to die. Oh wait. I took a vow to the people of Kirkwall and the Free Marches. Did you? I will not leave my flock. Would you let yourself die? Hopefully. There is no greater devotion than to lay one's life at the Maker's feet. There is no better death than to take the blow for another. <laughs> That's morbid. You don't hear that one quoted often, do you? Please, Your Grace. Sister Nightingale thinks there will be war. Then I must make peace. Yeah, you've been doing Settle such a good job. Yourself, Sebastian. I'm in no personal danger. I am Grand Cleric. Who would dare attack me? Oh, oh, I would. If you will not shield yourself, then I will be your shield. You will come through this safely by the Maker's name. I swear it. Right. Okay, well, that stupid quest is finished now. That's real nice. She says, uh, we tell her there's going to be a war. She's like, I'll make peace. And we're like, hey, why don't you get involved in this big dispute between the mages and the Templars? Oh, that's not my place. So what the fuck are you doing then, you contradictory motherfucker piece of shit? Calm down. Fuck you. <laughs> you have to go at night. That's when the ghosts come out. No. Oh, wait. There's no wait. such thing as ghosts, you fucking fruit. No. Matthew actually I'm watches... Happened Matthew watches day. those fucking ghost hunter shows and acts like they're real. They're awesome. What kind of a retard is he? <laughs> if there were really ghosts, do you think that don't you think there'd be like, you know, physical evidence or something like that? Or, you know, uh there'd be some kind of proof that they existed. Ah, eh, watch the show. Never mind. They got some things on there. I know. Cool. I'm laying a whole lot on your head there, Matthew. Just go back to quitting Muppet Babies. You'll feel better then. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> now we're talking your language. Oh my god, did you hear that? <gasps> a ghost! Zoinks! Looks <laughs> like we're going into the haunted house, Scoob. It's just old man Jackson. He was wearing a ghost outfit and flipping the lights off and on. <laughs> I would have got away with it too if it wasn't for you blasted kids. That's right, folks. You need any obscure cartoon quotes? Just ask Matthew, the thirty-two-year-old man. <laughs> Whatever, he'll hook you up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my bad. In that case, it's quite appropriate. Yeah. Hey, is that music? Where is that coming from? <laughs> I don't hear anything. <laughs> 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 <gasps> Oh, 
Oh, I got it. Save me, Lord. <laughs> Quit scratching your balls, <laughs> dammit. You're no use to anyone. I can't do that. Not Open it. Zoinks! Zoinks! This place is scary. Oh. I guess the buyer wasn't kidding. <gasps> It's not supposed to do that, is it? It's the creepy gardener! Where is that voice coming from? What voice? The words. I am singing. I hear it too! Friday! Friday! Ah! <laughs> is there a ghost? Would you stop that, please? That's right. Reason with them. We're getting closer. I can feel it, Hawk. Really? Was it the fact that you felt it, or that you saw a chair float up and stand on the ceiling? Look at this. My brother's junk was. Ew. <laughs> know it, but Bartrand was a sentimentalist. This came from our estate in Orzammar. When I was seven, I knocked over one of Mother's plates and. Good one, clumsy. It. My brother yelled at me for an hour. This was made by the artisans of House Saldras. The clay was from the Adros Etuna River, which never sees the sun. Arr! You're making this up. There's no way you're talking about the same Bartrand that I met. Maker's truth. There were tears in his eyes. I never thought that was possible before. Squeeze his balls real hard. That stupid plate was the whole city of Orzammar to him. Cool story. Or Shut up. With ghosts? Yeah, I thought we were busting ghosts here. Busting makes me feel good. Yeah, you, that must be why you're busting your pants all the time. Oh yeah, oh, ghosts! Some random artifact. The idol is still in the <gasps> It has to be. Oh my god! Run for it! Hey, thanks, ghost. It's nice that those ghosts will open a door for a lady. At least they have manners. Hey. You stupid ghost, there's nothing in this room, you dicks. I think that's funny, don't you? Shitheads. <gasps> oh! I told you books were evil. It's don't read them. library scene from Ghostbusters. Oh, oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Son of a bitch. As long as we're talking about Ghostbusters. Matthew, are you menstruating right now? Back off, man, I'm a scientist. <laughs> Let me guess, you don't remember any no. of that. Right. No! I know you My don't. My brother thought he was St. Jerome. Let's see if you can hit a moving target, shitheads! That's right, you can't. These ghosts must be drunk. They're just kind of flailing all over the place. They hate this. I like to torture them. All right, that's right, folks. Let's start the Brinkman! All right, looks like we're going up the stairs here. <gasps> I did. I heard something. You know, that didn't make me feel better. Eh, I'm sure it's nothing. What's the worst Zool! There is no Dana, holy Zool. If I see eggs pop out of their shells and start cooking themselves, I'm out of here. Aha! Huh? Stop where you are, ghost! It's a chick! Are you real? You've got to get out of here before it comes back. Sure, he's dead! Where's the idol? What are the you? American idol. Don't waste my time with your lies. Tell me where it is. Lies. You in a hurry there, Beric? I didn't exactly want to stay for dinner, but I think we've got a few minutes to hear her out. Nonsense. She's hiding something. Kill her. Don't lie to me. I know it's here. You must have found it. I swear. I don't know anything about an idol. Please, Billy Sangina. Idol. It's Billy Idol. Did you just say Sangina? Where is he? Maker, no. It's starting again. Maybe you shouldn't run down there and get killed by whatever's... <laughs> Never mind. Too late. Oh well. Uh oh. Oh my god, it's the thing from that shitty Fantastic Four movie! Alright, you asked for it. Hey look, I'm in rocks too! I can't keep this up. Hey bitch! I got some of this! I gotta kill all his ghost buddies. Oh crap. I can't keep this up. Ah crap. Go with go! 
Uh oh. Oh crap! Let's face it. Can't keep this up. Matthew, call the action. They're fighting. He's going upstairs. Hit him with the face. In the right face. There, yes, in the face. You guys sharing a brain over there or something? Yeah, naked. Uh oh, Barrett's about to eat it. Time to run back up the stairs. Right this away. This is it going so well? Come on, hey. Chris, get him! You knocked me down, you piece of shit. Run for it! Hey, he's half Ow. dead. We're almost there. Get up, run. And the uh, red-haired chick's gonna bite it. Your dick? Damn right. Yeah, he wishes. Yeah, Matthew loves getting his dick bitten. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! Quit swinging your damn weapon around and hit him! Standing at just the right angle where I can't actually Ouch. do anything to him. Stop hitting me with the base. Stop hitting me with that shillelagh. This is turning into a domestic dispute. He's throwing lamps at me and shit. Die, fucker! He's dead! This... This is a piece of the eye. He just vanished? Sweet. No, oh, I should have known Bartrand would lie to me. Of course he'd keep a piece of the statue for Maybe himself. Maybe you should give that to me. I didn't but know ghosts bled. Oh, There's a lot of blood for ghosts. Think of what we could do with this. Oh, you mean like go insane like your brother did? I don't know about you, Varric, but I don't want to end up like Bartrand. I'm not my brother, Hawk. The idol drove him crazy, but this is just one tiny piece. Oh, okay. I need this thing. Six years of my life have gone into this. The shard is my only hope of curing Bartrand. It's my only chance to set any of this right. What do you think, Matthew? Uh, keep it. What do you think, Brian? I'd say keep it. You guys are both idiots. All right, we're keeping it. I can't believe I'm saying this. If it means that much to you, keep the shard of craziness. I knew you'd understand, Hawk. Let's get out of here. I've seen enough of this damnable house to last three lifetimes. Let me tell you guys what you've won. Uh, his brother had the whole idol, and he went fucking batshit insane, ditched us in the deep roads, tried to have us all die there, and he, uh... Had a house full of uh, servants that he uh, ritually tore apart and and ate and stuff like that. So huh. yeah, so let's keep the shard from that thing. You know, what's the worst that could happen? <laughs> oh, it's just a shard, you know. Six years of his life has gone into. I don't remember if he actually this. ate anyone, but he definitely did fucked up shit, and there was definitely butt stuff involved. Uh, it's right up Matthew's alley then. Of course, yeah, and keep right. the damn shard. Of course, come on. Ledger, is it Heath? Smells like him. Nice and rotted. Heathcliff. Merchants guild ledgers. Uh, dwarves fighting over whose ancestors were the dwarfiest, whose gold is the shiniest. I never understood how he could stand it. Five minutes with them and I need a strong drink. You always need a drink, you alcoholic. Everything makes you thirsty. Don't try to blame that on the dwarven merchant guild, Varric. <laughs> You might have a point there, Hawk. <laughs> Bartrand wagered everything on the expedition. Everything for the chance to escape the guild. Make enough money and the guild doesn't matter anymore. You're free. Damnation. Let's keep going. Let's.